Hey Lady is an online community where women from around the world meet to practice speaking English together. It's the easiest way to find English speaking friends and to get regular practice, the practice that you need to speak English confidently and fluently. Hey Lady is a safe and supportive space for women with an intermediate to advanced level of English. Come and visit us at heylady.io and discover the English speaking version of you today. Well, hey there, I'm Emma from mm English, and it's time to practice speaking with me. We're going to practice talking about daily routines using my daily routine as an example. So we'll get to talk about my morning routine, what I do before I go to work, my workday routine, what I do at work during the day, and my evening routine. So maybe you like to watch Netflix or read a book or clean the house or go out for dinner, I'm going to talk about my evening routine as an example. I'll give you lots of chances to speak out loud and to practice with me. And the cool thing is we're also going to brush up on a little bit of grammar that you might need to use to talk about how regularly you do things in your daily routine. When talking about our daily routines, we use the present simple tense. I eat breakfast at 7 a.m. But adverbs of frequency can add more detail. They work perfectly to this. And I can choose any of these ones to talk about how often I do something. And that's why they're called adverbs of frequency. They show how often something happens or how often you do something. Now, for me, I would say, mm, no, I never eat breakfast at 7 a.m. That's a little too early for me. You try it. I always have my coffee before breakfast. So if you use always, it means that you're doing that activity 100% of the time, every time. But as that frequency gets less and less, your adverb can change to usually, sometimes, rarely, hardly ever, until you get to never, which is 0% of the time. Can you think of something you always do in the morning? What about something that you hardly ever do? I want to hear about it down in the comments. Now it's time for the fun part. Here is a list of activities that you might do in the morning. I've marked the ones that I do and you can do the same or you can note down a few different ideas if you like. Now some of these activities are really common. Most of us do them every morning like wake up, brush our teeth, get dressed, go to work. These are all things that happen pretty consistently. So we'll practice using some adverbs that help to explain that. I usually wake up at 6.30 a.m. Try it. You can also say 6.30 or half past six. There are lots of different ways to express time in English, aren't there? But pay attention to the way that I said usually with that y sound and the zh, you, zh, usually, usually. Try it. I always brush my teeth as soon as I wake up. I sit down at my desk and start working by 8 a.m. But I'm often a little late. Notice that I didn't pronounce the T in often. Often, it's silent. Though not for every native English speaker, but I don't pronounce it often. Sometimes I go for a swim before work but usually only when it's warm.
I hardly ever check my emails first thing in the morning. Now, to show the order of your routine, you can use sequences like before, after, then, next. All of these words are useful to help you organize your thoughts in order. I usually walk my dog before I go for a swim. After I get home, I make my coffee. Then I start work for the day. So even though I'm not giving you exact times, you still have an idea about the order of these events, which one happened first, as soon as I woke up, and what was I doing just before I started work. Our work routine is probably quite different. Maybe your day at work is really dynamic and it's always changing, or perhaps it's pretty consistent and you do the same thing every day. So you'll have to adapt this section to make it suit your work day. We're going to use mine as an example to practice with. I always have a meeting first thing in the morning when I start work. I usually work best in the morning. That's when I'm most productive. Sometimes if I'm really focused on my work, I won't even stop to eat lunch. Well, until around 3 p.m. when I get really hungry. You try it. I often take a break around 4.30 p.m. and go to the gym. I hardly ever go for a walk outside, but when I do, it boosts my energy levels. I rarely finish my workday by 5 p.m. The evenings are probably my favorite time of day. I try to use that time to wind down and to relax as long as I'm not working late. What types of things do you do in the evenings? I usually take my dog Frankie for a walk. Often we go to the park, but sometimes we go to the beach. I hardly ever cook. Shah usually does the cooking in our house, but sometimes we go out for dinner. After dinner, sometimes we watch Netflix, but often we'll go back to work for an hour or two. I never go to bed before 10 p.m but I always try to wind down by reading a book and drinking herbal tea. So now that we've been through my daily routine, I want you to share yours. I want you to write a few sentences down, maybe in the comments below, using the adverbs that we've been practicing with. But don't forget to practice saying these things out loud too, okay? Practice each morning this week. The repetition is going to help you to remember the different ideas, but also get comfortable saying these things and talking about them with ease. This is speaking practice after all. I hope you enjoyed today's speaking practice. I'm looking forward to hearing about your daily routines. I'm wondering if it's similar to mine or maybe quite different. Now, if you're looking for some more speaking practice with me, then check out this lesson right here. It's all about telling great stories in English. So check it out and I'll see you next week with another video.